my name's Craig, it's six o'clock, it's time for a Magic Live. Now today I'm gonna to do the two card and glass juggle. This is a fantastic opener by uh, Simon Lovell, and it's perfect for a bar environment or an environment where people have been drinking. Uh, it's a really fun trick, and I first learned it many, many years ago on a, uh, I don't know, a really old VHS tape from uh, Simon Lovell's. I'm gonna uh, perform it on Jack. Jack, uh, have you ever juggled before? Uh, no. I'm going to teach you the two card and glass juggle. It can be your new party trick. First of all, Jack, pick a card. Any card. Don't show me, show the camera. Okay. And just say stop. Stop. Great, put the card back there. Uh, did uh, you see the card, Michael? Yeah. <coughs> Card goes down in the middle of the deck, I want you to see, really does go. In fact, you know what, we'll, we'll stick it a little bit further down like that. Is that fair? Yeah. Look at that, lost in the deck. So, two card and glass juggle, all right? Hold your hand out for me. First of all, uh, there's three parts to this. The first part is the one card juggle. So that's the first part of this, the one card juggle. I'm gonna take the, uh, the eight of clubs. That's not your card, is it? No. No, good. I'm gonna put the eight of clubs right there. So this is the one card juggle. It's the eight of clubs in the hand. That is the one card juggle. Okay. It's not particularly impressive, is it, the one card juggle? Because it's literally just one card in your hand. It's not the greatest juggling move of all time. This is where it gets interesting. We get a full glass of water and we balance it on the card try not to knock it over. This is the one card and glass of liquid juggle. Now we have the eight of clubs with a glass of water on top. Slightly more impressive, and I can tell that you're feeling the stress. Now, it's still not the ultimate version of this. The ultimate version is to take another card, Queen of Diamonds. Is that your card? No. No. So we put the Queen of Diamonds right there on top of the glass, and that is the two card and glass juggle. You have the eight of clubs, you have the queen of diamonds on top, and you have a full glass of water in the middle. Now still, I don't think Michael behind the camera is too impressed with the two card and glass juggle. So this is where we actually do the magic part. When I snap my fingers, the eight of clubs that was at the bottom of the glass now becomes the top card of the glass. They oh. change places, but they don't change places because the eight of clubs was at the top, was at the bottom, it's now at the top. You'd think the queen of diamonds was at the bottom, but no, if I spread the deck out, look at this. In the middle of the deck, face up, we have the queen of diamonds right there in the middle of the deck, which means that can only mean one thing. Underneath the glass, we we have one card and one card only now. What was the name of your card? Four of Diamonds. That would be the Four of four Hearts. Parts, would that sorry. be the one? And that is the two card and glass juggle and magic trick in one. You can now be a new speciality act and hit the uh, the entertainment circuit, Jack. You can make a name for yourself with the two <coughs> card and glass juggle. You can be a juggler, you can be a magician. The world will be at your feet. So you do this in bars mainly? Yeah. You have to do this for Raven next time we go to an office night. Absolutely. I think she'll be too drunk to go. <laughs> don't think she'd be able to hold the glass. Anyway, do me a favor. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. If you want to see more videos like this, like the video, subscribe to the channel. I'll be back again tomorrow at six o'clock with another Magic Live. I'll see you then. Mm -hmm.